Okay, now we're going to show you an advanced feature that we have added to our system designer. And that is the archive button. Now before we get into it, we don't want you to get confused with the save design button. Save design will download your design as an image for you to record it or display it to somebody. But archive will save it for later so you can still edit it and make changes. In this example, we have created a simple home surveillance system. And to save it for later, you just click on archive and then you have to give it a name. And then simply click on save and exit or save and continue editing. Now to open a design that you have archived, click on continue design and then click on open an archive design. And as you can see here, our design is saved and we can open it and continue editing. Now it's important to mention that archive will save the design to your browser by default. If you wanted to work on this design on another computer or send it to somebody for them to work on it, you need to download it as a TXT file. To do so, click on archive again and then check the download as text file option. And again, we need to give it a name. As you can see here, the browser has downloaded the design. And if you wanted to import it into your application, you can click continue design and then import design from file. Once you have located your TXT file, you can click start design and continue working on your design. And that's it. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed designing your new surveillance system.